Creating a custom URL for your Facebook page is an easy and also a very valuable thing to do. For example, if your business is as long as ours is, My Video Voice Productions, or even longer, My Video Voice Productions of Tampa Bay, that's an awful lot to request somebody to type in into Facebook to try to find you. It's much easier if you go by acronyms, perhaps, in your day-to-day -day business, MVVP, or if you just want to shorten the name of your company for Facebook purposes to My Video Voice and that falls within your branding. So how do you do that? Well, initially when you create a Facebook page, and we will do that briefly walking through by going to Create a Page, and it's going to ask me to be an administrator because you can only create a page from your personal profile, not your organization's page. So I must revert back to being Luann Walters. Then I can create my page. Now you'll notice it asks for my company name. So after I've chosen nonprofit or whatever my category is and I type in my company name, that is going to be the initial URL that gets assigned to my Facebook. Let's go back though to My Video Voice Productions. So you can see that while we've called it My Video Voice Productions, we have actually shortened the URL to My Video Voice. That we did upon creating the page. However, if I wanted to now change that to MVVP TV or simply MVV, I would do that by going to facebook.com slash username. Your username is your URL. Custom URL and username, those are uh, swappable. They are the same thing. Again, in order to do it, I must be myself, not my company. Then I can check. I'm going to check my, uh, my video voice. That's the, the organization or the company that the page that I want to change the name of. And before I do it, I can simply check to see if the username that I want to use for my custom URL is available. So in this case, I'm going to say MVVP TV. Now, I'm not changing it at this point. I'm simply checking to see if that is available, and it is available. So what's important that Facebook is reminding me of right now is that I can only do this one time. So I need to be very sure, and you need to be very sure as an organization that your username is something that falls within your company branding, so your organization's brand guidelines, and that it's something that you're going to be using from here on out. Could Facebook change the rules? Of course, they do every year. But at this particular time, you can only change your username one time. Once I know that that's what I would want to use, I would use Confirm, and I'm not going to do that for the purposes of this tutorial, but I would simply hit Confirm, and then I could come up here and I could type in MVVPTV, and it would appear, just as my video voice takes me to my page. And it's as simple as that. So good luck, be sure that you know exactly what your URL is, and happy changing.